Jesus is the light of the world. We believe he saved our lives. So declare. Church, are you ready to worship God in this place? Come on, that's good for us. Are you ready to worship the King of Kings? The reason why we're here today, the one who sets you free. Come on, lift up a shout of praise in this place. Hallelujah! Come on, if you know it, sing it out. You made the blind man see. Clap your hands with me. Make the lame man walk again. You called the dead to rise. Come on, that's why we dance. And that's why we dance and live.
John 8, 12, Jesus is the light of the world, and whoever follows him will not be in darkness. So I'm going to give you one more chance to forget where you came from, to forget how nice you look, and celebrate the King of Kings, because he's the light. One, two, one, two, three, go ahead. Let's continue to worship God together today. Amen. Can we stand up on our feet? Can we just take another step and just lift our hands? This is our way of saying, God, I surrender. Anything I was holding on to, God, I let it go. And we're laying down today our day at your feet. We're laying our worries at your feet, God. And we're going to you and worship God, not asking for anything, but to tell you how good you are, Jesus. To tell you how wonderful you are. We give you the highest praise, God. You're worthy. You're worthy, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. By your stripes, we are healed. By his nail piercings, with By his blood, we're washed clean. Now we have the victory. Come on, sing the power of sin is broken.
Come on, don't let your praise stop right now. He's great. He's great. He's faithful. God, we give you the highest praise today. We give you all your due today. We shouldn't be here right now. We shouldn't be standing here. I know I shouldn't be standing here right now, God, but you look down with your grace and mercy. It's new every day, Jesus. We're so grateful. We're grateful, God. You pulled us out of the depths of hell, God. You saved my family, God. You saved my marriage, God. You saved me from anxiety, Jesus. We say thank you today. We say thank you today. We say thank you, Jesus. Say hallelujah. hallelujah. Come on, lift it up all over this building. Let's give them the highest praise. Say. Success. Oh. This is not about us. It's all about you, Lord. Come on, just one more time. Just say all the glory. No music. Let's make it personal. Lord, I love you. Say, Lord, I love you. Come on, talk to him. world Lord, I love you. God I need you I love you Lord, I love something's happening right here in this moment say Lord I need you Lord I need you more than the money more than the success like the air that I with the organ and in your way just talk to the Lord come on sing a new song to God right now come on this is not about a show this is about us responding to God come on just talk to him tell him how much you love him if you're watching online right there in your living room just tell him how much you love him thank him for his grace thank him for his mercy thank him for him come on right now just lift him up this is not a show this is an exchange between you and God Lord we love you there's nobody like you, Jesus. Come on, this is your moment.
just hallelujah one more time just the voices sing hallelujah No lights right here, just one big audience. Father, in this moment where you can't see anything, let us see you. Father, for the businessman and the woman that came in here looking for something, I thank you that they'll find you today. God, for the parents that are dealing with infertility right now, I thank you that the answer is not a baby. The answer is you, God. For the person who just lost their job, Father, and is wondering, have you forgotten about them, Father? I thank you that the answer is you, Father God. For the person who just got a bad doctor's report this week and they're planning their funeral, God, I thank you that the answer is you this week, Father God. For the person who didn't get accepted to the college that their whole family went to, Father, I thank you that the answer is you, Father God. And today as a church, as a body in this room and all around the world, we take a moment and put our feelings to the side and we lift up the name that is above every name. It's the name of Jesus. And at that name, every knee shall bow. And at that name, every tongue will confess. And we're not going to wait till we go to heaven. We're going to do it now. I dare somebody to give God the greatest praise that you have in this building. Come on, give him the greatest praise. I said, give him the greatest praise. Y'all not going to have no music tomorrow. Can you give God praise with nobody prompting you and nobody? Is that the best you got for the God who woke you up this morning? You shouldn't be here right now, but he saw you and looked beyond your faults and saw your need. Somebody give him a shout of praise. In See, some people that are around you right now and they're doing the bougie golf clap right now, they forgot where they were five years ago. But some of y'all remember where you were five years ago. You remember where you were last year. You remember where you were last week. You better give God some. There's a praise erupting out of me. Excuse me while I give God what he deserves right now. Pastor Mike, why are you guys doing all of that? It doesn't take all that. Well, yesterday when OU was playing, you were shouting. And yesterday when Alabama was playing, you were shouting. And when LSU was playing, and when the Lakers play, but they're not winning victory for eternity. But my God has won the victory. Let's give our champion the shout of praise that he does. I do not know what y'all came to do this morning, but I think somebody brought their praise with them today. Y'all quit, stop it now. We don't even shout like that. We don't even do nothing like that. But when I think about Jesus, all he's done for me, when I think about Jesus, how he set me free, 